Good morning, Boney. Oh, that was a long couple of days. Woo. Actually, I think it's been a month. <laughs> oh, it's good to be back. Oh, I almost forgot how I left this place. Ooh, need some work. Let's head off this way. I think we got some adventuring to do. What do you think of this spot? This looks like a good place to cross. Oh, you don't want to go? Okay, well, I will swim across. You stay there. Alright, let's see what's up in this area. Ooh. I'm down to my last pork steak. Looks like I'm going to do some hunting. Four pieces of bread. Hmm. Ooh, yes. There we go. Shh. Sheep! Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah! Didn't even see me coming. Look at that. Oh, it didn't even drop anything. That wasn't worth it. Oh, look, bees! Oh. Hey, okay, I think I might... Yep, I'm gonna clear this area out. For sure. We're gonna open this up so I can remember that those bees are there. That's the second, I think, hive that we found. Ooh, pork. My favorite. Here, piggy, piggy, piggy. It's okay, it's just a sharp blade. Mm, where'd you go? He must have known I was coming for him. <laughs> oh! Yeah, he definitely knew. <laughs> hey, it's okay, it's okay, you're just gonna die. Thank you. Give me the pork chops. Shh. I'm hiding from the other pigs. <laughs> Perfect camouflage. They would never notice. <clears throat> Anyways, let's go this way. Oh, look, I drowned. You got anything good for me? I'm not holding a Nautilus shell. Okay. Well, you can also perish. Let's see. We need in some more materials. We gotta get enough stuff to be able to build up our house a little bit. Because right now, it is lacking in detail and uh, just professionalism. But, we need to do some exploring. We need a few more wood types, I think. And any of the other resources I can gather and stuff in a chest for now will also do. This honey is definitely going to come in handy later for some contraptions. And maybe just a good food source. And not the greatest food source, but just something fun and new. Alright, let's swim back across. Hey, Boney, you still over here? Yeah, yep, he didn't stay where he was supposed to. All right, this creeper hole I dug <laughs> seems to work really, really well. Success. Okay, we're back. My legs are tired and my cheeks are chafed. That's why you don't wear chain mail and go swimming. All right, let's get everything put back and get a boat made. Looks like it's raining. All right, we're gonna stock up this boat for a little bit of a trip, and we're gonna do some fishing while it's raining, because there's a 2% chance of getting more fish, or loot, or something like that. Anyways, ooh, look at that, lightning. Oh. That was so close. All right, if I give you, <clears throat> before I drown, ah, uh, air, ooh, wow, lightning, huh. So close. Imagine if I was in the water when that happened. Ooh, shockingly. And I'm wearing chain mail. Ooh, that would not have been good. All right, so if I give fish to one of the dolphins, they're going to lead me to treasure and or shipwrecks. Anyways, that's good for me. I would like treasure and a good shipwreck would be fun to explore. But let's do a little bit more fishing because I was down to my last fish. And look at this guy. <clears throat> he apparently wants fish too. Or maybe my legs. He's definitely not trying to fix my boat. Hey, you can stay as long as you don't scare my fish away. It'd be kind of neat if the dolphins would just boot you out of there. Whatever. Looks like he's dancing. At least he's happy. Yeah. Get that groove on. Ooh. Nice beat. 
I think I think you're in a place in the boat. Let's watch the sunrise, buddy. Yeah, I forgot about that. I so sorry. Uh well at least it was your last sunrise. Enjoy it while you can. Alright. Thanks for the boat back. Well, he did scare away the fish, but I got a couple of puffer fish. Not bad. Not bad. That'll that'll help me out a lot, actually. Especially exploring those ruins underneath the ocean. I almost die every time. I know, I know. You can use the magma blocks. But, uh, I get damaged all the time. And I don't really want to uh, press shift all the time. I want to get some potions made, so this is easier. Oh, no chest! No chest in the captain's room! Unheard of. Okay, well, hopefully there's at least one in this one. Alright, let's try in the cargo hold. Oh, what's down here? <clears throat> if I can actually... There we go. Paper! <laughs> it's paper! Uh, anybody watch Waterworld? I kind of feel like that right now. This paper's worth a lot. At least I got some. I guess I'm not really making paper. The map and the treasure map there is hopefully worth it. Maybe there's one over here. Did I get lucky and get another chest? No. Okay, that's fine. More shipwrecks. And treasure, hopefully. Maybe I can get a couple of... Uh, what is that? Heart of the Sea. But then I need a bunch of Nautilus shells, so... Probably gonna have to do a lot of drone hunting. Or more fishing. But in order to, to get what I need fishing, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna need some better enchanted tools. Like lure and luck of the sea. And mending, for sure. I, I think mending is extremely important when you wanna be fishing. I'm gonna harvest some kelp because my food's running low and kelp is pretty abundant everywhere. It's nice to keep a little bit in the boat, too. Just in case. Also, it's kind of fun to watch the dolphins play with the items. I wonder if I can make uh, that work for me. Make a mini game out of it. Kind of hard to play a mini game by yourself, but I know it can be done. Uh, oh, okay, got some kelp. Let's get in the boat, make this easier. Yeah, here we go. Gonna scoop it all up. Okay, wandering off, we found a taiga biome or something like that. But finally, we have some spruce trees. This is what we were looking for. I am so excited. I actually have not been this excited to see spruce in such a long time. Oh, hi. Hi there. Nice close up. Sweet. And I'm going to make sure I get as many saplings as I can. Ooh, and look at that, sweet berries. I will take a couple of those, put them in the boat. Maybe we can find a couple of foxes. All right, cool. Hopefully we'll find a couple more of those. One's good enough for now, though. That's pretty much all you need to get it started. Ooh, watering trader. Hi, guy. What you got? Uh, it looks like you dropped your, uh, your hey, hey, your llama. You, you, you left your llama here. Okay, I'll take the lead in the llama. This looks like a good spot to make a little base, a little hobbit hole. Something nice and cozy right in the wall of the hill here. Nothing too fancy. Just going to make a bed and some small storage areas. This is about a day or so away from spawn. Nice to have camps. Alright. It's getting dark out there, so I'm just going to put some temporary blocks down. Cook up some of that food. Smelt some stuff. Block off this entrance, because I don't want a creeper sneaking up behind me. Ruin my day. Before I get a bed down. Oh, where is the bed? I hope I put it in the boat. <clears throat> okay, well, before I forget, I want to put a little torch up. Just like I did back at the other one, except for I don't have any netherrack with me, so this will just do for now. Just a couple of torches. Then I can see it from shore. Yeah, strip. Mm, that looks alright. 
Okay, got the bed. Okay, now let's, uh, hmm, what are we gonna do? Put down a crafting table. Oh, where do I wanna put it? Hmm, there's good. I'm being picky, I don't want that there either. Or that. <laughs> or maybe even this. Let's get rid of this. That doesn't look good either. I got some time. Okay, <laughs> there we go. Black that off. Open this up a little bit. I'm gonna make a little shelf along the back side here. Just not right there. Yeah, like that. Just like that. Okay, got some this dried kelp. Not the tastiest, but hmm, better than nothing. I ate my last pork chop. Okay, let's put some of this stuff in there. I don't need any of that. Uh, we're going to tidy this up a little bit more, because, yeah, why not? I'm here, and I've already spent enough time on it. I might as well make it look a little bit better. I think this might go into the hill, down into, like, cave systems, possibly later, or something like that. If I'm ever here and make this a bigger base, at least there's that option. And I really like the way the beds look when they're on half slabs, or, or level with half slabs. It looks more like a little bedroll thrown down. Less like a actual home, and more like a camp, you know? Sleeping on the floor right in front of the furnaces while I'm smelting up my food. Yeah, see? Like that. This is alright. I'm not going to get too fancy with it. I just want to throw some stuff in these chests here. And change out these doors. Oh, no, nope, I don't want it like that. There we go. And one right there. There we go. Why? It'll make it a little bit more difficult for mobs to just run in through behind me. And, well, probably a better way to do that. I kind of like it. It's a tiny little hole. Okay, what's in here that I might need? I definitely need some more room. Can't carry it all back, so I'm gonna prioritize a few things. So while I wait, I'm just gonna cook up some more food. Leave some food here, take some food with me, put some in the boat, and have some in my inventory. And definitely take the saplings and the wood. Hey. I was getting stuff out of the boat and putting stuff in the boat. Oh, no, he just gave me the armor. I guess I'll leave that armor here. But we have a treasure map. Actually, we have a couple of treasure maps. We're pretty close to the one, and it looks like this one's a decent distance away, but we'll make it to both of them. Definitely need to find whatever's in those chests. So let's go this way. It looks like it's right over here on this island. I don't know how quickly I'm going to find it, and if this is mostly water, it might take a second. Oh, no, that was actually relatively fast. Let's see what we get. Okay, cool. Heart of the Sea, some TNT, diamonds, and some chainmail. Hmm, I got enough chainmail. I think I'm going to put down another chest and just leave some of this here. I don't need sand. Maybe I'll take it. Uh, no, I don't need the sand. I can get sand almost anywhere. Definitely want to keep these two diamonds. Say goodbye to the hobbit hole. It's time to head off in this other direction. Way off yonder. Alright, uh, anyone know a sea shanty? Ooh, what's this? Another Tyaga biome. Sweet. Uh, nope, treasure's not there. Keep going. Sailing off into the sunset I wish I had more words to this song Not quite a sea shanty, but it is what it is. Hey, look! I know that place. I think that's a base of mine. Oh, cool. Looks like the treasure's like near a place we seen last episode. I think this is the one I left in the boat that I found over here. But I never looked for it because I didn't have time. 
Yeah, this place doesn't look the greatest. It's definitely ruined. Um, well, I'll tidy that up before I leave. Looks like it's right over there. Oh, wow. <laughs> you drowned. Uh, uh, kill me before I get my bed set. So it looks like the last time I was here, I forgot to put a bed down. So I'm going to have to remedy that. Just in case I get murdered by a drowned. Turn into one of the Soggy Bottom Boys fan club. Oh. Yeah. Alright, well, with them dead, I'm going to cook up those couple of pork chops. Beef, actually. Upgraded. Mmm. That's what's for dinner. Beef wrap kelp. Or kelp wrap beef. Be kind of neat. If I could make some, what is in here? Let's see. I want some spruce, and we're gonna spruce this place up a little bit. <laughs> okay, maybe put a little box around that. Iron would look better, more like a brazier or something. But the wood's fine. Alright, I really don't like it when they're in the water like this, especially without potions, but hopefully I can do this before my potion runs out. I think I only got one left. Oh, is it here? I'm going to dig up half the ocean before I find it. It's right there. <laughs> Standing right behind it. Can you believe that? Cool. Okay, what do we got? Ooh, cool. Not bad. Not bad at all. It's a pretty good loot. And I should have just done this in the first place and chopped the chest. But whatever. Hey, sheep. I need your wool. Hold on a second. Wait, 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 wait. Thank you. You do? Yeah, yeah. Did I get three? Yep, I did. Perfect. Now I can make a bed and make this place a little more homey. And safe. Er, ish. As safe as a ruined... I don't know what this used to be. I don't recommend living in old is. castles that are drafty. <laughs> Especially ones that are half sunk. Alright, I want to do the same thing with the beds that I did in the last place, because this isn't a house, this is just a camp. A little place to make my way from point A to point B. And why put two of them down? I don't know. Might have a friend. I have friends. Okay, let's go this way. I think we're done there for now. We will just head off back home. Yeah, let's go home. We've got an inventory full of stuff, the boat's full. Need to empty out and sort out everything else that we got. Maybe add to the house. I'm gonna grow a tree right there. That sounds like a good plan. And one over here. A couple of these spruce trees, these uh, two buys growing up here, and a couple of singles. And then we can harvest some more of those and also plant the two sweet berries that I found right over there. Alright, I'm impatient. I don't want to <laughs> hurry this up a little bit. I want some more of this spruce wood. This is going to look great. Hi, what do you got? Uh, yeah, actually, I think I'll take a melon seed. I don't have any melons. Um, I think that creeper called in an airstrike. Oh shoot, my tree's on fire. <laughs> Ooh, in hindsight, it probably wasn't the uh, greatest idea planting this big old spruce tree right next to my fire. <laughs> oh well. I didn't get as much wood as I wanted to out of that, but I got a couple of saplings back at least. And now we can make the inside of my weird little house look 
a little bit better. I like these doors out of most of them. I do like mangrove, but I haven't found any of that yet. And I'm pretty excited about the new cherry wood and the new bamboo stuff. But I haven't found a jungle yet or a cherry biome. I'll have to figure out where those are and mosey on over there and collect some resources so I can make some other neat stuff. But for now, I think I'm going to try to stick to this color palette. I think it kind of works. I don't know. What do you think? It's a work in progress. And not quite the way I want it yet. I don't know if I like the way the chains look on that. I wish they were just a little bit higher. But kind of looks okay. Nice little view from the balcony up here. Keep it open so you can just fly on in. When I find Elytra, eventually. And a little uh, tree planting. Got a lot of saplings, and I might as well put them all in one place and make one mega tree. And I am low on food again, and kelp is just not doing it for me, so I'm gonna eat meat. Well, while I was bringing back a couple of sheep, <laughs> I was surprised to find a random zombie jockey that happened to hijack my cow. <laughs> and then while I was trying to get here safe, I accidentally looked at an enderman and nearly got killed. And now the zombie is in my base <laughs> because the Enderman let him in. <laughs> All right. Cool story. Look at that. Yep. I think I earned a cake. Yeah, I survived that ordeal. And look, I got another honey source in my world and this one is right next to my house <laughs> that's cool that's so cool i don't have silk touch so it's gonna have to stay in this tree but i'm gonna trim it up a little bit so it looks more like a tree and less like a big mess of sticks and twigs that are just worse than my house <laughs> let's get rid of this and maybe get some more saplings back, because I do need more wood. I'm not doing as much mining, so I'm not getting a lot of coal. But I can make some charcoal out of this, or use it for, I don't know, pretty much anything else that I need. Hey, look! <laughs> All full up on sticks and twigs and a few apples, too. Ah, feels nice to be prepared. Got my backpack on. Cruising along, picking up anything that I can put in my pockets. And my pockets only fit so much, so eventually I need to make it to the end. So we can get some shulker boxes, and I can fill those pockets even fuller. And then I can empty this backpack much quicker. Yep. Soon I will be almost automated. Not quite. Clearly. It's Minecraft. You don't know how to make Minecraft unless you have the create mod. And this is bedrock. So we can't have nice things. Not yet. But eventually I'm going to be able to sit down and relax knowing that I have shulkers full of whatever I desire. And they'll be putting auto loaders. It's a good dream. It's a good dream. Yep, one day. But today, we're just gonna do some mining. Because we can't do some end busting without tools and equipment. Plus, I really, really want to go mining. I love it down here. Look at this place. It's so wonderful down here. I love the glow squid, the environment of the, uh, what is that, the beautiful lush caves, oh, glow berries, the glow lichen, and the giant dripstone caves are 
awesome. They're just so cool. I love exploring down underneath the underground in Minecraft. Alright, I need to get some lava and possibly find some dripstone so we can start to create a few lava sources. That means we also need enough iron here to get cauldrons and also maintain our tools. And I definitely want redstone. I like making contraptions. And also we need that for uh, compasses and maps. I want to map out my area too. Mmm, getting lots of redstone. I like that. Wish I had fortune though. That will be the next step, is enchanting. Ooh, gems. Sweet, I can now make a telescope. And, uh, ooh, what is that now? Uh, amethyst uh, and skulk makes the something. I can't remember the name of it right now, but yes, I can possibly do that if I find the deep dark and some skulk. Then I need to get silk touch so I can get a catalyst. Oh, that'll be sweet. Then I can make all kinds of really cool stuff. Yeah, I can just sit back here and enjoy the view while everything is working around me. Yep, it'll be pretty cool. What do you think? All right. I like it too. Hmm. I think it's time for a nap. I'm pretty tired. That was a heck of a mining trip. And I think we're going to call it a night and an episode. So, sorry we didn't do too much, and sorry it's been so long. But I had a lot of real life stuff going on, and I'll try to do better now in the future. I'm new at this YouTube stuff. Thank you for patiently waiting with me, and I will see you in the next episode of Minecraft The Guy Update with Blue Shirt Guy. Adios.